No, we're talking about a new kind of tribalism, a new kind of belonging, a new state of consciousness and a new state of heart in which there is a miracle happening and must be. There is a miracle of the heart that's happening in you and me as we awaken to it. And as quaint as it may sound, it is a miracle of love. And as religious as it might sound, it is a miracle of God's love. If that word God is a word for the the beingness that's within all things, that's within you and within me. That beingness is in love with itself. Being is in love with itself. All being is in love with itself. And it's in love with all that it creates. As a being, I am in love with Sunrise Ranch. I'm in love with those cows that Derek and I were chasing this morning. Being is in love with all that it creates, and it's in love with each other. Now, there's a tribal kind of love. It's a me and mine kind of love. That kind of tribal love is an old crystallization of the heart that leads to nuclear weapons when given the intelligence of gods. How does that work? The intelligence of gods with tribal mentality of the heart. Doesn't work very well. So what's at stake, and indeed what's happening, is a combustion in the heart that's happening in humanity and an awakening of the heart. I would suggest to you that the com- that combustion, that that fire is far more profound than a nuclear explosion. It's a strange comparison to make, but when you think about it, the power of love is, is what's getting released destructively through an atomic bomb. All that power, the power of creation, which is the power of love, that's locked up in those atoms, well, we're just going to release it through nuclear fission. And think of all that release of power on a destructive basis. But through a kind of fusion, the fusion of being, that same power can come together as it does on the sun. If you think of the power of fusion on the sun, how powerful is that? A couple of nuclear bombs on planet Earth pale in comparison to the fusion that's happening on the sun. And in the same way, when you and I are in love, the power of that means that the power of a nuclear bomb pales in comparison to that. And all this power that's coming up through the human psyche has a place to go, which is fusion instead of fission. And I would suggest to you that the reason it's manifesting in fission in a nuclear bomb is because it's manifesting as fission between you and me out of tribal mentality because of a state of the heart in which there's separateness and there's a tribal kind of love which is a me and mine against you and yours kind of love. Without a knowing of our natural affinity as being. Being is in reality in love with itself. 